because you heard rumors from little faggots on this fucking game. Because people spread rumors like crazy on this game. And they really need to be taken to a room and beaten and fucking shot. That's the only way that I can really think of. But that's what they do to make items crash, is they spread rumors. You buy an item, you keep it. There's, you just have to keep it. Who cares if it goes down? It is the best item, or the rarest item in the game. Alright? For example, I will tell you a little story. It's not story number two, but it is just a little story. I paid 144 mil for my purple party hat a year and a half ago. Why well, actually, just, no, a year ago. Six months went by, purple party hats crashed to 80 mil, and everybody used to told me, Oh, you know, you're never going to be able to sell them now. Oh, you got to get rid of them. Oh, you got to get rid of them. And I basically said, blow out my ass. But what I did was I saw that red party hats were 102 mil. And what did Nightmare do? He upgraded for 22 mil. So I spent, what, like 166 mil for a red party hat, right? Because you had, I paid 144 in the G for purple. And then to upgrade, right? Red party hats right now are 285 mil. So, I've, what, made like 120 mil just by having an item sit in my bank. So, you guys gotta really think about that. Alright? My last story, and this is how to maintain your money. If I were to sell all of my items right now, all of my goddamn items that I have, right? I would have about 1.1 bill coins, alright? And, you know, that's, that's good. But guess what? Six months later from now, how, many, how, how much coins will I have unless I add skilling, you know, money to it? I will have 1.1 bill coins, alright? Six months later, if I didn't sell everything, I'd probably have 1.4 bill, 1.5 bill worth of items. So, you guys want to invest, then you guys really just keep your items. That's basically my tip right there. Do this list, see if it works for you, if it doesn't then it doesn't, but you guys just have to be patient. To skill and make money, then you start buying your items. Once you buy an item, then you keep it forever, and you'll be a smiley face like me. But anyways, please leave your nasty little dirty little fucking comments. But also, if this helped you, then leave a comment for that also, because I'm really curious if my method, you know, is going to help you guys. But, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Oh yeah, one more thing I forgot to add. Um, I feel kind of like a dumbass not adding this right now. Um, if you merchant for money, like, you know, single item merchant or whatever, you can sell those items. Like, don't buy, like, 20 Bando chest plates and then just keep them as a Dream Gear list item. Don't do that. No, that is not that good, okay? You really only need one. So, if a DFS is on your Dream Gear list, buy a DFS. But... If it, you know, if you're, let's say, merchanting a DFS and you have five, then there's no reason to keep five. So, as I said before, you never sell your items ever, 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 ever. That doesn't apply if you're merchanting an item. So, you know, whoo! Because probably some of you people are probably thinking to yourself, Oh my god, I'm gonna buy 20 party hats and never sell them! No! No, 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 that's a waste of money. And waste of money is waste of time. Which equals money, which equals time, which equals you're fucked. But anyways, like I was saying before, the GE crashes and the GE rises. So your items one day might be worth a lot more than the other. Just be patient. Because they're your dream list items. So if they're on your list, then you don't want to sell them. You want to cherish them and worship them like Jesus. Well, no. Okay, some people worship Jesus. Some people worship a motherfucking banana. So, yeah. Whatever you worship, okay? You want to worship your Dream Gear items. But then again, you know, a lot of people, you know, they merchant for money. Like, I used to merchant a lot for money, rather than doing skills. You can do any way to make money for your Dream Gear item. You just make more money, you buy one item off your Dream Gear list, do it again, do it again, do it again. Um, merchanting, you know, items... A lot of people don't like to tell you, you know, publicly say what they merchant, because if they publicly say what they merchant, then the item will become harder to buy, 
and become harder to use. But me, I like helping people. Like, for example, Bill Gates, the richest person in America, right? He has, what, like over, probably about 100 bill right now, invested in his stock and his home, equity, and all that good shit, right? Everybody knows how he made his money. Everybody knows how he did it. Well, you see somebody in this game, you know it's their little secret. They're motherfucking cult members. I call them cult members because they're assholes. But, anyways, yeah. What I did for 600 mil, uh, let me see. Godswords, DFS, yeah, use those things. They're pretty good. <laughs>